everybody I am back again and I know what you're gonna say you look the same in the past other three videos why is that um thing is I've done a ton of recording and I'm just enjoying recording and I found a ton of questions that I want to get them going so I could put them on my computer um, edit them and then upload them on different other weeks so it doesn't look like I'm the same all the time but I found this questions and this one is guys and girls do that annoy them and I'm going to put this in sections like part one and part two so part one is going to be um, the girls one um, because I've wrote a ton of stuff on this one to actually read up for you guys and I wrote all these in my own words so if you're wondering why I'm looking guys because I am looking at this because I didn't actually go on I didn't go on the internet to actually you know go all down and read because if I did I wouldn't waste my time worrying about I would be on this right now first one is being over jealous and this one is definitely not me I know I said um, some of these are me but this one isn't me because I'm not a tight asshole like that <laughs> but um, this one is keep in mind he's with you and the reason why he picked to spend the time and to build a relationship with you so most girls are just over jealous with other girls because of what they've got but you've always got to appreciate with what you've got um, if you start being jealous of another female later on, he, will, he won't be that understanding, which is true because he knows that women get jealous of other women. Bear in mind, um, he's in a relationship with just you and he loves you. Um, he wouldn't be wasting his time um, spending time with you and building a relationship. Really? I'm halfway through recording. You've got to keep in mind that he's pitched you to build a relationship with you and to spend time with you. Um, like, like it says, um, if you're going to start being jealous of another female later on in the relationship, he's not going to be that understanding. He's not going to want to know. Um, it's just going to go to the pettiness of like, it's just going to be really petty. And if it's just going to cause arguments, you know, that's why it says he's not going to be, you know, understanding later on. Um, he will think you've ne neglected everything he's done if you start being um, jealous of another female because you know relationships like of mine he does everything for me I don't do, I don't ask him for anything he just does everything I, unexpectedly and I don't know about and you know I appreciate everything he's done it's just like you're gonna start being jealous of another female later on in the relationship yeah they are gonna start being understanding and they were gonna start feeling like you've neglected him and everything he's done for you. The next question is being overly dependent and um, this goes for a lot of women and it's every guy has loves the fact that he can help out and make a woman happy however it is a complete turn off if you don't know how to handle some things yourself and I've seen like most of these programs of women that overspend and they don't have enough for their bills these men come and help them with it and um, the thing is, if, they, if you're going to keep asking for help with bills and that and you can't be capable of your own money or, you know, keep an eye on it and what you're spending and stuff, it, you know, it's quite harsh, harshly to say, but, but, you know, men wants to see how you go with your own money. They want to see if you're capable of doing things saving things up yourself. Three is showing too much skin and honestly I've seen so much of this with girls with their boyfriends. Um, this one is he may find you attractive in dresses but not not ones that show a lot of skin. Um, I've seen most girls do this in public with their other house and the men getting all over them. It's quite disgusting. It really is because like you see these girls just wearing like you know a really pretty dress and it shows so much skin. That when they go out in public, um, you can see all these men like either wolf whistling them or going up to them or giving them the numbers or asking for their numbers or you know getting all touchy touchy when they're with their other half. Um, you know it does some yeah it does cause a lot of shit. But these were it you know what do you expect when you're going out in public? It doesn't like that. I know a lot of women do, but um, I'm not you know I'm not not like no offense to like women, but if you do that then you know. If you're with your other half and you do that, I'd just be more careful. But if you do it and you don't give a rat's ass that like your other half is there and you love the attention, then why are you with your other half? Because you've got to have self-respect for yourself and your relationship. You've got to be 
respectable for your relationship it's just not on i think it's not on like you know i could go on forever and ever about this but you know i'm not gonna waste my a lot of my time doing it so but you get the you get the picture um, the next one is being too emotional oh my god this one is just i've seen this one way too many times i wrote some women have the tendency to cry more frequently however that doesn't mean you should get emotional about everything you have to see if you're a strong woman and you can take care of yourself and honestly this is 100 percent true um a lot of women um i'm not saying long distances because this you know it's fair enough if you're at home and he's like in the distance and you know you're upset but like, yeah and that's not i'm not going on to that one but this is where girls just constantly cry and cry and cry and I don't know, it's like either they're uncertain about things and I don't know, I can't actually explain it, I can't, you know, but at this moment I can't actually explain it but um, it's just like, I've seen a ton of girls do this in public just constantly crying and getting into their arms and this and that and this and that um, most men don't really like it if you're going to constantly do it because they want to see how strong of a woman you are and if you can take care of yourself. I mean, if you can't take good care of yourself and you're constantly upset about things, then I don't know, it's really weird because if you're not in a relationship and you're always emotional, um, I don't, it depends on how the man takes it, I suppose. But it's like I said, most men like to see if you can take good care of yourself. The last one, and honestly, this one is definitely me because I feel so awful about it, but it's the way I am, and I've cut down a lot of it, but I try not to, but this one is doing too much nagging, and I wrote on this one, everyone forgets to do a thing or two sometimes, doesn't mean you should hold that over his head, if you constantly nag, then he won't listen to you at all, it might result him avoiding doing something for you, just out of spite. If you feel that he is busy and will forget what he has to do, politely ask him once if you're calm about it, he most likely will do it, which is absolutely 100% true. So yeah, I do that um, quite a bit with James. I tried to cut, I've cut down a lot of it actually, and um, yeah, I feel quite bad asking him to do things, and then um, if he forgets, I tend to remind him a bit. Um, he does do them, but if he forgets, I do them myself, so it's not much of a problem, but depending on what my mood is, especially if I'm at home coming home from after work and despite that um, I tend to do the same if he asks me to do something um, I tend to forget sometimes, a lot of the time. I think it's just one of those things so yeah, you know, just got to be careful and not to get on with them too much because it's just going to get into one of them bad habits and it'll cause arguments and blah and then you all end up saying something that you shouldn't I like didn't mean to in that relationship so all right guys i hope you enjoyed this video um i'm gonna do part two of this one on um on the men's one about what um, girls hate what men do um i hope you guys enjoyed this video and sorry if this like, like dragged on a bit it seemed like it dragged a bit but i will get this edited and uploaded soon and I've got a fair few more ideas um, videos of what to do and I don't think I'm going to do any more today because I recorded throw already. <laughs> Alright guys, I'll see you guys later. Bye! Um, the one thing about tattoos is that if you're actually thinking about getting one, do what I do. Um, leave it for a few months or even a year, which I've done 